Welcome back to Crypto Warehouse. My name is Mike, and today we are going to go through the bombshell news of the merger of some of my favorite AI projects. This has come from left field. Nobody expected this to happen. Certainly not me. And if you are a regular viewer of the channel, you will know that we have been talking about two of these three projects in particular on and off now for almost one year. So what we're going to go through today, we're going to have a look at the, uh, the project. We're going to go through the article, what this entails, what happens to the tokens that you already have. Then we're going to go and have a little look at the, the market cap. We're going to see what it's going to do to the AI crypto market. And then we're going to give you my conclusion on where I think the market cap of this new project can go. Before I do any of that, can I please ask you to like and subscribe to Crypto Warehouse and help us grow the channel. Only 16 hours ago, the news broke that there was going to be an AI crypto token merger scheduled for community vote on April the 2nd, which would create, according to this article, a $7.5 billion AI token. A token merger to the tune of $7.5 billion consisting of artificial intelligence protocols, Singularity.net, Ajax, Fetch.ai, Fetch, and Ocean Protocol and their token Ocean is scheduled for a community vote of approval on April the 2nd. According to the announcement yesterday, there will be three separate votes that will take place between now and April the 16th. All three projects will vote on this decision and it will create a new token called the Artificial Super Intelligence Alliance Token, or ASI for short. The merger will create a company worth $7.6 billion across the tokens. The three tokens current combined market cap is 5.3. If approved, it will then be possible to swap your FET token for ASI at a rate of one to one, the teams wrote. If you hold 100 FET, you will swap it for 100 ASI. However, the other two tokens won't be one for one. And also there is some news in here about what to do if your token is on an exchange and also what to do if you have a token on your non-custodial wallet. Down here then, Singularity and Ocean will receive 0.433 tokens of ASI for each of their respective tokens. So just under half, if you've got a hundred uh, Ocean tokens or a hundred um, Singularity tokens, you'll get roughly 43 ASI tokens. And more importantly, what do you need to do well, if your tokens are on an exchange, not a lot. They're going to work with each exchange to ensure a smooth conversion and your holdings will automatically be converted to ASI tokens directly by the exchange. You won't see Ocean or Ajax on the exchange, but don't panic. Your tokens are there. Just look for the ASI symbol. And equally as important to me is the ability for you to swap your Ocean and Ajax tokens on your self-custody wallets that swap mechanism will be available indefinitely. That's what I want to hear. I do not want a six month or a three month closure for this because some people don't look at their wallets from one year to the next. Then the token, the Super Intelligence Alliance token, the ASI token will be launched with the common goal of developing blockchain based decentralized AI protocols. Now this sentence is incredibly important. They cannot be controlled by centralized parties or large stakeholders. Now that line says more than is written, and I'm gonna go over that in a second. So what will this do to the AI market in crypto? Well, it will shake it up dramatically. As you can see, Near Protocol is coming in at 7.7 .7 billion, Render at 4.3 billion. Those three tokens combined, as we've already discussed, will be $7.5 billion. And in my opinion, it will become a bigger project than Near Protocol. It will become a bigger project than Render and the Graph most certainly. I'm going to give you my reasons why in a second. But as you can see here, Fetch comes in with a market cap of 2.8 billion. Singularity has a market cap of 1.75. And further down here, we have Ocean with a market cap of just under $850 million. So these are three tokens, all in the top 200 all going about their own particular business. 
We've already discussed FET on this channel many times. We've discussed Singularity on this channel many times. Both are in different parts of the industry. So for me personally to see this happen, it really has come left field. However, we're gonna move on. I'm gonna give you a very brief conclusion on what I think is going to happen. So we've seen the merger announced. We also spoke on this channel a few weeks ago about Fetch starting a real world uh, con a conglomeration of existing companies in crypto and existing companies in the real world to try and harness the benefits of AI for businesses. That's already in place. They have partnerships in place. I'm gonna leave links to those videos on the screen now. And as I've already discussed, Fetch and Singularity were two of my favorite AI projects for this bull run. So to see them combine, it's all my Christmases come at once and hopefully all of your Christmases come at once. What does this mean for the token? Well, first of all, I do not believe for one second that this token is going to be below $10 billion for a very long time. As I said on the stream today, projects with AI in their title will gain traction by the simple fact that they will have AI in their title. So when you create a token, artificial super intelligence, ASI, people are going to look at their respective exchanges, whether it be Coinbase or Binance or Crypto.com, and they're gonna look at what markets they can invest in. As we've already seen, this is going to make it the biggest AI project in crypto. So people's bags will obviously have Bitcoin, potentially Ethereum, maybe Solana, but then they will look at meme coins as we've discussed many times on this channel, and now they will look at AI. And why is this so important? Because AI is in everyday life people talk about AI, people talk about deep fakes, people talk about how AI is being used with WorldCoin, with Sam Altman, with the World Economic Forum, all of these things associated with AI. We are going to bring retail a product, ready-made product for them. They do not compete. One, for me, is an institutional-based AI product. Singularity is more of a retail-based AI product. But as again, we covered on this channel two weeks ago, Fetch and Singularity are trying to work on the problem with AI and hallucinations. They are already working on this, working closely together. And I don't think the timing of this is a coincidence. This vote will finish four or five days before the halving. So going into the Bitcoin halving, we are going to have a brand new AI token. And honestly, I do not know where the price is going to go to, but I do believe it is going to be the biggest AI project in crypto by market cap. I also believe it's easily going to go to $10 billion. Where it goes from there, I am not going to give you moon boy math or any predictions because I cannot quantify what this company is going to do. I cannot quantify how much money it's going to make. I can only base it off Fetch and its business plan and Singularity and its business plan. But for me, the future for all three companies looks a lot rosier than it did 48 hours ago. If you like this type of video, make sure to like and subscribe to Crypto Warehouse. Turn the notification bell on. Remember, this is not financial advice. This is my opinion and my opinion only. You have been great. I have been Mike. Until the next video, goodbye.